Hello everyone, welcome back to episode 2. In the last episode, Farah met Juanita and they went out to the local bar for a drink with the goal of meeting new people. However, she ended up getting sad drunk, not the most ideal headspace to attract the right people. So, we did go and send her home. Uh, but it's the next day now and the goal is to throw a house party today to get to know the locals better because we need three friends for this um, new in town scenario challenge now I did go and up ahead and update the park um, where we went last episode and her backyard as well which I'll show you in a second so she does like fitness um, so I'm going to go and send her on a run an energized jog she can go do that and while that's happening I'm going to show you the backyard so here we have this is the doors leading out from the kitchen now we have a nice little pergola space here a patio down here we've got a fire pit and an eating area and then around here we've got her barbecue a sitting area and a hot tub over here now I did go a little bit bougie on this but you know you'd often have people over at your house so having lots of things to do is important. So up here then, up here is the pool area which I quite like. I like how it's elevated. It must be hot out, she is sweating. Let's get you a shower, Let's take a speedy shower because we want to get cracking on the day. We need to invite a sim to our home, visit a neighbor's residence, have three friends and work on our charisma skill, comedy skill, mischief skill. So friends is the goal today but we are going to practice our charisma in the mirror when you get out of the shower. Alex is calling. Hi, we just moved in down the street. Come on by and visit whenever you like. Oh, that's so nice. Okay. So this must be Alex here. Alex Moya, let's do a friendly introduction to her. And this must be her home here. Pretty cute. Okay, so it's literally down the street from our house. This is our house just here. Okay, nice. We can insult her house and yard. It's a bit rough. So, oh, this is a little bit dull, isn't it? It has so much potential. The decorator in me just wants to get into build mode and fix her house for her. Oh, maybe it's an unpleasant conversation. This conversation has become rather unpleasant. Try apologizing or just walk away. What did she say to her? Maybe we can compliment her house. Oh my gosh. Why are you insulting her? No. What has happened to you today, Farah? Getting sad drunk was not the way to go. Maybe she's feeling a little hungover and that's why she's being a bit snappy. Oh. She's got PMS. She's feeling a bit dizzy. Let's see if we can turn this around. Let's apologize. Oh my gosh, stop insulting her. This is not going the way that I thought it would. Let's head home and we can work on our career a little bit. All right, so what we have to do for our career, we have to chat with the client is the first thing. Done. Okay, now we want to do the splash art. Okay, she's feeling pretty sleepy. So let's see if we can get this splash art approved. Let's have a look at it. Um, sure. It's normal quality. Let's see if we can get it approved. Nice. Let's give her a nap. Okay, Zoe's calling. Hey Farah, I think I have a crush on Sunny Denny. 
I don't know who that is. Do you think it's worth a try? Um, I mean, she's, I think she would say, I guess you could go for it. I actually think she would be like, yeah, go for it. You go, girl. All right, I think what we'll do, we'll let her sleep till about six. And then we'll get up and organize this party. All right, so let's invite, so it's already 7.30, so let's invite some people over. Um, it could be a small house party to start with, I guess. House party, this is what we wanted to do. Uh, the host is obviously going to be Farah. Now we will invite, we'll invite Zoe, Alex, because she's our neighbor, and we probably need to apologize to her. Junita, maybe Jay Huntington the third, and Janelle. We seem to have good relationships with them, and we're going to have it at home. People should be around at any minute, so let's cook a little bit of food. Maybe we should make some vegetable dumplings. Look how cute she looks in her new outfit. I like that her tattoo shows at the back too. Somebody's already making themselves at home in the pool. Is that Alex? Yep. Oh my gosh, look how buff Janelle is. Look at those muscles on her arms. How did your vegetable dumplings go? Oh, excellent quality. Nice, nice. This is a custom content bar, so <laughs> she's standing a fair way away from it, but it doesn't take up as much space as all the other bars. All right, host socialize with guests. So let's thank them for coming, first of all. That's a nice thing to do. It might be just a coincidence, but Farrah can't shake the feeling that others are just constantly judging her. Is it her hair, personality, friends? What is it? Barry is afraid that this won't be the end of it. Who's judging you? Oh, no, stop insulting Alex. Let's get to know her. So maybe we should scope the surroundings and see who she finds attractive here. After Farrah finished scoping the room for attractive faces, she hasn't noticed anybody interesting. Great. <laughs> well, while we're here, I am going to just go into Cass. And put some CC on these faces. We have Jay Huntington the third, we have Zoe, we have Janelle, we have Alex over here, and Juanita was already CC'd up, so I didn't have to do that. She's angry drunk this time. I thought we didn't have a drink. I thought we just had a virgin mojito or something. Oh gosh. And she is irritated too from having her period. This is so much fun for her. I thought she'd really enjoy having people over, but maybe she doesn't. I know you want to wash the dishes, but please dance with her. Nice. Well, <laughs> the party is over. It was a party at least. You'll find a consolation prize of a gently used book in your Sims household in inventory. Let's check out what book we got. Charisma Volume 1. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's fine, that's fine. We need to work on our charisma anyway. Well, our first house party was maybe not the success that we thought it might be. But, anyway, I'll do a little cleaning up for her. Because she just wants to have a bit of boogie at the moment. That's fine. I think she's actually happier now that everyone's gone. I'm not going to lie. Anyway, even though that didn't go to plan... And it doesn't count for the invite a sim to your home. Fantastic. So we... <laughs> okay. Okay, we're not doing so well on this. We need to get cracking. It's 2am in the morning. I think we're going to go to bed and start fresh tomorrow. Okay, Farah is up this morning feeling a little bit worse for wear. Um, but I've sent her off on another jog just to clear the cobwebs out. And then when she gets back, we'll get some food in her and she'll be feeling much better. All right, let's have some scrambled eggs and bacon this morning because she's still not feeling great. And, and we did want to go on a date. So maybe, maybe we do a bit of a blind date and invite them back here because she does also want to go swimming. And it might be a nice way to have a casual date so now with this dating app we do have specific dates we can look for us 
like someone that catches our eye or we can go on a blind date a female blind date a male blind date and one night stands and hookups okay we might not be using those but we will look at these ones here I think I'm just gonna I don't know what Farah's preferences are so I'm gonna send her just on a blind date okay here is our date this is Raymond Barclay we'll do a bit of a flirty introduction this is some random Aylan Lillard over here too. And let's do a little bit of a flirt and see. And now it does want us to ask if they're single. So we can do that. I mean, if they're on this dating app, they should be single, right? Oh. Farah has learnt that Raymond is married to Fenida. Then why are you on this dating app? All right, well, I think we're going to call quits on this date and we'll try again. Now, who is our date this time? Pretty sure I saw it. she has red hair. Here we go. Why have we got Heidi Clifford just randomly in our house too? Was that supposed to be our first date? Oh, gosh. So this is our date. This is Nina, Nina Caliente. So let's do a little bit of a flirty introduction with Nina. She's feeling playful. Awkward encounter though. Okay, let's try asking her if she's single. Farah has learned that Nina is single. Okay, let's do a little bit of a flirt and see how that goes over. Okay. So maybe she's not interested either. Can we ask her what she's into? Oh, Zoe's calling. You won't believe it. Sunny Denny is such a sweetheart. I'm in love. Oh, that's so nice. You just go up to random people on the street and ask them their romantic preference. How rude. Okay, this is not going so well. Let's just invite her out to the pool because who wouldn't love this backyard? And maybe we can recover or maybe we'll just end up being friends. But either way, it's good to go on a date to get to know people. Farah doesn't like how that conversation went. She's being oversensitive. She's, oh no, she's just not feeling it, is she? I think we're going to end this date though, because that just did not go really well. It's 7 p.m. <laughs> maybe maybe we should concentrate on another gig today then, because the getting to know people today has not gone that great. He is feeling a little bit sleepy, but I would like to get another gig done for her. This one maybe? Young Artist Camp Demonstration? Maybe that would be good for her hanging out with some younger people. Getting a bit of perspective on life maybe. Alright, let's get this started then. We'll go to this class. Meet with the class. Okay! Farah's heart swirled with joy at the opportunity to pass down her artistic skills to the next generation of talented painters. The children's eyes were wide with wonder as she gave her demonstration and they leapt into action in an attempt to recreate her painting. The counsellors expressed their gratitude for letting Farah sign the wall as one of, the, of one of the camp's cabins as well as slipping her a bonus payment. Nice. Oh, she's feeling much better now, I think. And we still have the artwork, so we might put that up here for her. So tomorrow I think we might start our day off with a run. Oh, we've got bills and... Oh my goodness. The bills are $3,000. Do we not have auto lights? Can someone tell me, is that because the lot is so like packed is the the lot is worth more is that why the bills are more all right enjoy your pancakes because we've got to get our little butt to work today we have bills to pay that we cannot pay all right she's finished her pancakes let's get in here and resume this painting maybe she'll have to sell some of her paintings as well let's get that approved cool four hundred dollars um we're going to have to sell these too Let's sell to collector. And oh, we're getting close. If we just do another painting over here, 
Okay, that looks like a sad clown. I mean, it's not my cup of tea, but let's sell it to the collector anyway. And we are getting close. Let's do an abstract painting this time. I mean, this is quite cool though. Let's sell that to the collector. Let's sell that to the collector. It's not worth all that much, but we're gonna have to select a gig. We've been here for a few days. Uh oh, maybe we can just try anyway. Let's hope that this is fine. Yes, approved. Nice, but we still can't pay our bills. Nice, $335. Is that enough to pay the bills now? Let's see, not travel. Pay bills, no it's not. <laughs> that one was worth $300, that's good. We're so close Farrah, keep going. Is that enough? Let's see if we can pay our bills. Yes. Now before you go to sleep, I know you're tired, but we need to chat with the client. Yes, so that got us a bit of money back to start off with. Okay everyone, that is going to be it for this episode. I know that it was a bit of a grind at the end there, but yeah, please let me know if you know something about the um, the bill situation. If you're enjoying this series and you want to see more, please like this video, subscribe to my channel and make sure you hit the notification bell so you're notified every time I upload. But we'll see you in the next one. Bye!